Let's remember the Bataclan. On November the 13th last year, gunmen stormed into the concert hall. Less than three hours later, they and 89 fans were dead. It was an American band called the Eagles of Death Metal playing that evening. Tonight, they came back to, in their words, resume their gig. Not in the Bataclan itself, it remains closed, but at the Olympia Theatre in Paris. Many of the survivors returned this evening as an act of remembrance and resilience. Lydia Vassallo was in the Bataclan and attended uh, the concert this evening. And good evening to you. And how important was it to you, Lydia, to go back to this, this very poignant gig? I, I really needed it. I mean, that was the, the final uh, chapter for it. Um, yeah, it was more, more than important. How have you been since November the 13th? Sad. I was really sad. Have you been able to, I mean, go to concerts and to go to theatre or anything? Go to Paris? Yeah, like? I've, I've, been, I've, been, I've been to Paris, I've been to gigs, I've been to the theatres, I've been to the cinema, I've been shopping, taking the transport like everyone. It was not the same. Mm. OK, so tell, tell me what happened in this concert tonight. And, and, and it just can't have been an ordinary it concert. Was, it was the most extraordinary um, gig of my life. I mean, it was really emotional, but not the way I thought it would be. And I think everyone needed it. And that um, tonight the show proved it. I mean, did they literally finish the gig that they had started on November the 13th? Is that what they did? It must have been a little more special than that, a little different to that somehow. Y yes, they, they played longer. They asked us to um, have a few seconds of silence to remember those we lost that night. Um, they say they love, they love us and even more than last time. Mm -hmm. It's interesting that the lead singer of the band, um, Jesse Hughes, has in the last couple of days talked about guns and the need to... how he thinks if there had been guns there, uh, it would have been... A, 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 more people might have survived. I, I just, it's not the very European view, let's face it. I just wonder whether you have reflected on that, that kind of response to that awful night. I I don't think people should wear guns because, uh, like we can see in America, there is a lot of accident and crazy people just use them to kill other people all the time. But if that night myself I had a gun, I would have killed them. Mm. Do you think this does... Just going, for protection. Yeah. Do you think this event, you've just been to this event, I, I, I don't like this word, but the, the word closure, I mean, do, has it actually closed the chapter? You said a final chapter. Is that, is that how it feels to you now? Uh, not closure, but I managed to finish what I started, and, and that was really necessary. Um, they cut us during what we were having fun, and, and suddenly we had to run for our lives. So tonight was um, the way for us to finish what we started. Lydia, thanks very much for talking to us. Thanks.